Hi friends, are you ready to code? Today we are looking at an app called Box Island. And when I tap on it, it begins to load. As it's loading, I just wanna remind our friends that coding is a language that we are learning to, um, to program our computer. So our computer doesn't always understand our words. So we need to talk to our computer the way it understands, which is through coding. You will notice when we open up Box Island, there are two areas to explore. We're gonna start first with the hour of code, and we're gonna go into the six to eight year old section. Even if you are a little older, I recommend starting here, just so you get your feet wet and you know what to do. Now, once you tap on the triangle, a character appears. I've named my character Brody after my dog, but if you tap the pencil, you can change the name to anything you like. You will notice when we're in um, the first level, there are 20 areas that we're going to learn about, writing sentences, loops, algorithms, all sorts of fun things. And you will notice that we have three stars per level. And you'll notice that in some areas, Mrs. Ledford only got two stars. That means I did it, but I might not have mastered it. And truly, in order to go on to the next level, which would be a little more challenging, you wanna get three stars almost every time. That means you thoroughly understand the concept. At the very end, you can tap and get a code, um, our of code certificate. So let's just see what we have. The first level, I'm going to warn you, is going to be super easy. So we're learning sequences and we have a hand that is pointing to what we need to do. So we're just going to tap and drag, and now we're ready to run our code at the bottom. And like I said, that was fairly simple, but it does get a little more challenging. This means let's go back and try it again. Great idea if we only got two stars or one star. We're gonna move on to level two, and you'll notice that there is no hand or hints. So now we have to move left or right. So I'm going to start by moving forward one block, and then I'm going to go to the right. Fabulous, look at that, all three stars. Now this time I'm going to purposely write my code incorrectly. And you'll notice that I need to go over to the left, then up two blocks. I am purposely going to have him go right into the water and maybe buy some shells, just to see what would happen. Oh, it did not work. At this point, I need to click, I'm sorry, touch and drag, and remove all of my code where I think I've gone wrong and start again. Once I tap on the gear, you will see that I have the opportunity to listen to the music. I can go back to the island. I can even go back to the very beginning. Once I complete all 20, I'm ready to go on to a little more challenging, the age nine to 11. And you will see that I can get through all of those levels as well. Again, they are a little more challenging. So let's go back and talk about Box Island over here. This is using everything that you've learned in the Hour of Code. And again, it starts out relatively easy and gets tougher as it goes. This is a free app. Um, but it does have a paid version to it. So on this area of the box island, you can only go so far and you will see the next couple levels locked. That's because you need to buy the paid version. All right, friends, I hope you have fun coding in box island. <music>